if you use YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, or any other social media platform, let me tell you that they're all fighting for your attention, that you are losing. No nonsense talk in this one, let's get straight to the point. What do these social media companies want? Your attention. But why? One thing that most people might not realize is that all these social media platforms, they're all businesses at core, not just apps. And like any other business, they all chase this one very important thing, profits. And how do they create profits? All social media companies earn from a major source of income, which is advertisements. These are like the ads that you see when you're scrolling from one post to another on any social media platform. Which means that they want your attention to show you ads so that they can earn more profits. And they do this in a very smart way. So there are two main objective of the algorithm of these apps. Number one, to make you spend more time on the platform. Number two, to show you ads that you're most likely to buy. Let us understand this with the help of an example. Pandu. He is Pandu. Pandu loves Bollywood gossips, cringy reels and controversies. He spends most of his time scrolling on Instagram reels and seeing Bollywood and controversies. Some random guy working in Facebook in Silicon Valley might say, Guys, Pandu is engaging a lot in Bollywood and controversial posts. Keep showing more of these to him. So, what does the algorithm do? It keeps showing on the posts in the same genre and the more you see such posts of the particular genre, you're more interested in it. And you want more, more, more and more of such posts. And if you think about it, that's what happens. And why not? Because what do these social media companies want? They want you to spend most of your time on their platform so that they could show you more posts more posts in your interest and hence more ads for example let's talk about instagram reels a very familiar platform and almost everyone uses it if you open up instagram reels you might notice that not everyone gets the same kind of reels recommended the reels that you get recommended are very much in the field of your genre that excites you and keeps you scrolling for hours like pandu but hold on what if you think for a second that how does Instagram know that what am I interested in and showing me reels in that particular topic? The answer is behavioral patterns. Let me explain. Social media algorithms track and collect information about you from the amount of time that you spend on a post while scrolling to the content that gets your most engagement. Everything is being Tracked. But what's wrong in this bro? And the outcome of this is that people are so hungry for that kind of content that they get addicted to it. And that's what social media companies want because that's giving them more amount of time on their platform. But that's beneficial for them, not for you. But what is the solution to all this? Well, I can't be advising you to do something, but what I can do and what I do on this channel is just share my experience with you all. And hence, this is what I do. On social media, you might find a variety of people who had influenced your life. You can find comedy creators who create comedy just to entertain you and some self-help influencers who might make your life better or some handsome dude who might be telling you to quit social media. No, 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 no. I'm not telling you to quit social media. I'm just telling you to change up the way you use it. And here's how. Instead of feeling depressed, left out and inferior about your own self due to social media, change it up. Feel motivated, inspired and positive after using it. But how? Following the right people. Here's a simple social media hack. The moment you feel that social media is getting a little toxic for you, simply start filtering your following list. And once you filter that, you know that who are the people who are adding up to that toxicity. And now, just simply unfollow. 
That's right. This hack was absolutely game changing for me. So it's definitely worth a try. No, 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 thank me later. But let me just tell you one thing. I myself create a very positive, informative and crazy content for you guys. So you might just consider to subscribe, follow on all other social media platforms. That's right, Pandu. And I keep saying this all the time. Social media is a beautiful tool that has its own pros and cons. But we got to focus on the pros more. And one of them is that it's an amazing learning platform. There are a variety of content creators on social media who will teach you about a new skill. Well, I'm not flexing but all these beautiful edits that you saw right now they were all created by me. Yeah, me only. and i have learned the skill of video editing completely through youtube yes you heard that right completely through youtube just like me you can learn absolutely any skill online youtube or to courses and make your social media a weapon and not your distraction if you like the video definitely consider to subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one until then Keep learning, keep being positive, keep happy and subscribe.